Hey guys, it's Shalice from Living Color Duct Tape, and this is going to be a kind of a quick video. Um, I know that, uh, showing all my laundry back there, I need to fold. Um, I did the Revital of Challenge, I know that some of you know, and um, some of you don't. If you don't, um, I got the L'Oreal Revital Lift um, Cream from Influencer for free to review and try out about a month ago. I did the 14 day challenge. It was great. Um, the only complaint I had was that with the summer months, my skin gets super, super oily. And so I uh, said, I can use this for the winter, but I'm gonna go back to my serum, blah, 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 blah. I'm going back to it. Um, I've had breakouts like you can see right in here is a breakout um i have dry patches right through here it's really hard to tell in this lighting but um just really not so happy um oh excuse my hair I'm, i haven't showered yet today i just ran errands so the next the second half of this video will be me showered put together and using the revital lift but um, I'm just not happy after stopping using it, which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. But I decided to make this video, and I'm going to give it another try. I'm going to try it today when I take my shower and get ready to go to my show um, and just see if it makes a difference. I remember it making a difference like the first day um, last time I used it, and so I'm hoping that it has the same results. Um, my skin is also very, very... Um, it's been abused. <laughs> I'm in a show called Disaster right now. And it is um, heavy makeup. I'm playing a washed up disco um, star, disco diva. Sorry. Her name is Lavora Verona. And um, I wear a lot of makeup for that. And then on top of that, for the second half, after the disaster where there's like an earthquake and a tidal wave and blah, 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 I have special effects makeup on this side. And I'm pretty sure that's why this side is getting the brunt of um, like the dryness and the scaliness and even my lips. Are, look at that super dry lips so I'm um, I gotta try something so I will see you guys in a bit after I shower wash my face and use the revital lift and uh, we'll see if that makes a difference so I'll see you soon hey guys this is Shalise I'm hoping that this there we go gets a better representation of how now moisturized and hydrated my skin is um, this is after showering and excuse all the mess behind me but um, uh, doing the revital lift again and the dry patches I mean of course there's still breakouts because they have to heal but uh, the dry patchiness that was here is gone the dryness on my lips is gone so let me go ahead and pull out so this stuff is phenomenal and I didn't think I was gonna like it during the summer but after not using it I think I'm gonna have to start using it again so anyway that's my results I hope you like them I'll see you later all right guys this is so weird I'm trying to find a way to stand my camera in the bathroom so I could tape tutorials and stuff like that and better lighting I don't know if it's gonna work but that's what I got so far anyway um, I wanted to do one last check-in Ooh, my that's a little better one last check-in with the revive lift challenge I don't know if you can tell the difference I can totally tell the difference in my skin with um, using the Revital Lift again. Um, I checked in a few days ago, excuse my dirty mirror, um, about having to start reusing this because my skin was getting so dry again. And there were several dry patches and I was breaking out and doing all kinds of stuff because of the show I was in. And it definitely is much better. So what I found, the trick was, um, I also use Aloe Pure that I got in my Boxy Charm a few months ago. And this stuff is magical. I love this stuff. It's amazing. It's great. Um, but it wasn't moisturizing in my skin. It was repairing some of the damage, but it was still, I was still getting those dry patches. So what I've started doing is using this in my T-zone. Right now I'm sweating because it's hot in here. Like all along my T-zone and all the areas that get really really oily and then using this in the dry sections and then mixing it all together and it's been a much better combination for me so that it's not super oily 
and super greasy looking, but it's actually um, hydrating my skin really well. So if you have combination skin like me and you notice that you're getting dry during the summer and you don't want to use something that's super um, heavy on your skin, try these two together. Sorry, there's something blocking my view. My, uh, I can't see what I'm doing. Anyway, try these two together and let me know what you think. I promise it'll be a game changer. So anyway, just wanted to jump in with that and uh, I'll talk to you guys next time.